Man versus machine can be a difficult battle indeed. Many thanks for joining us. Our sign language interpreter tonight is Marisha Owiti. Let's get into it. And more talk tonight, more talk in political circles after ODM party leader Raila Odinga hosted Baringo Senator Gideon Moy and President Uhuru Kenyatta's younger brother Muhoho Kenyatta at his home in Karen. Moy and Kenyatta were ostensibly checking in on Odinga as he recovers from COVID-19. But the session is bound to raise speculation as to what the three were really up to. Coming hot on the heels of reports that Odinga may have initiated talks of possible alliances with other leaders, including Deputy President William Ruto. We begin tonight with KTN senior political reporter Duncan Heimer. On Tuesday morning, ODM leader Raila Odinga, Baringo Senator and Kanu Chairman Gideon Moy, and President Uhuru Kenyatta's younger brother Muhoho Kenyatta held a meeting in Karen. The duo said they were here to check and wish Odinga quick and steady recovery. Nonetheless, a highly placed source indicates that the meeting between Gideon Moy, a member of One Kenya Alliance and ODM Supremo Raila Odinga, focused on President Uhuru Kenyatta's succession. Just as they say a picture is worth a thousand words, Muhoho Kenyatta's presence in the meeting could be the writing on the wall in the world of politics, which keep changing based on interests at hand. On Saturday, President Kenyatta and Odinga held a six-hour meeting from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m., which came a day after Odinga received feedback from his emissary Kakamega Governor Weekly for Paranya, who had met Deputy President William Ruto last week in the Masai Mara Game Reserve for an overnight meeting. According to a source, by meeting the President on Saturday for lunch and then Tuesday meeting with Gideon Moy, it was a reassurance of the handshake unity, BBI push, and a possible reunion between One Kenya Alliance and ODM party, whose friendship was fractured during the Matungu by election, where ANC flawed ODM in a chaotic voting exercise. Jubilee Vice Chairman David Morathe is on record saying there will be new alliances come 2022, with President Uhuru Kenyatta being keen to hand over to a unit he trusts. Wenzangu, to sitelezi, to let a demolition squad badala ya wajenzi. Should Odinga and One Kenya Alliance join forces, then DP Ruto, who is organizing himself and a UDA party, will be forced to unveil fresh faces in the national politics, assuming all factors remain constant. Duncan Hemba, KTN News. Interviews to replace retired Chief Justice David Maraga continued today with law scholar Professor Kameri Mbote facing the Judicial Service Commission interview panel.